Hello everybody, I hope so you're doing very well. On the episode today, I go make a spiritual journey to my roots when I starting bike touring. I tell you on this episode what you needed for the first time you planning go bike touring. Alone or in group, cookware, clothes, navigation system, camping, camping stuff. I tell you everything. By the way, I'm the Portuguese guy and let's start the fears. If I put the fears on this hand and the desire on this, when I started, my mind is full of fears and I need to balance the fear and the desire. What have more weight on my hands and my mind? If you wanted, because all of us have fears. If you wanted cross that barrier, that mountain, you need to want it a lot to cross. And when you cross that barrier of the fear, everything running more smooth in your life. This is my experience. This is what I share with you. Wait, wait. I want to tell you more some things about the fear. Because in our society today, the word fear, meaning shame, weakness, taboo. We are persons and our feelings need to be respect for everyone. And one of the ways to understand the fear is talking about that, not hiding under the bed. Maybe you live all your life with your fears inside you, but if you can talking about them, maybe your life is more easy. Let me know in the comments below if you like it, this type of content, fears because it's the first time you go in bikepacking and bike touring and imagine in your mind how many fears you have. Put on the comments below and I promise if you have many interest, I make a special, a special but special episode about fears. I tell you what I wearing or what I wearing 25 years ago. It's a uh, normal clothes, uh, running clothes, hiking clothes. Uh, and today you have many possibilities. You go to the Decathlon and uh, you can find a very nice trousers, 20, 25 euros, a sport t-shirt. And if you are here in Ireland, you need a jacket and a waterproof jacket. But uh, for that, sometimes the Aldi and Lidl are making fantastic promotions and you get the things cheap. You don't need uh, fantastic clothes like Castelli. And if you searching in the, some videos I have uh, here on the channel, you see my clothes I use. If you have any problem, you not cry the money because the cycling clothes like Castelli and another brand is very, very expensive. Well, for the first time we're planning going bikepacking or bike touring, if you planning to pass like one night out and you make like 50 kilometers uh, one day and next day you make another 50 kilometers, it's a very nice experience. And uh, the food, you have many options. Eating on the restaurant, you can buy in the supermarket, you can bring for your home, you have many options. Normally, uh, what I do it when uh, overnight, I bring sandwich from home coffee and some noodles this is what i do it but uh, it's up to you because uh, you like some types of food and maybe i like another type of food i cannot tell you what you you bring i remember 25 years ago i pack some sandwich and go into the, my mom's kitchen i make some sandwiches and uh, put on the rock sack and let's go bike kicking trip or bike touring trip Today is one night. I give you some options where you can sleep. It's up to you. You can go into the BNB. You feel more safe, maybe. You can, uh, while camping, if it's permitted, I recommend you. Or you can stay in the campsite. I love it because on the campsite, you have a facility of you take a shower. And for me, the shower, when uh, I'm out, uh, the shower, it's it's a luxury I have. It's a luxury. I don't know if it's the same with you, but for me, the shower at the final of the day is a luxury. But uh, you see, you have many options. I give you these three options for you. 
and uh, maybe while camping uh, for the first time alone is not uh, a very well recommendation but uh, you have a BNB you can stay in the BNB and next day you wake up and and starting again your route many options what bike I need I need a special bike no you don't need a special bike for going on the first time bike packing or bike touring a hybrid bike a mountain bike uh, a gravel bike any bike almost is suitable for going one thing you need to bear in mind is if the bike now have bosses on the rear side on the triangle uh, maybe you cannot put panniers there you need to maybe leave with you a rucksack this is the only thing i see the limitation of of bikes and another limitation is you need to know where you're going what type of surface you're riding if it's tarmac if it's gravel if it's in the mountain you need to see because like if it's loose sand maybe it's better a mountain bike and they have some mountain bikes normally the mostly old models have bosses on the rear to put a rack and panniers bear this is in mind because that you are not limited it's not ah, i need to buy a, a specific touring bike to make this trip no this first trip is for you have only idea you expend less money possible because after that after that experience you have you not cry your money if you said oh, i don't like this i i this is horrible i don't like it to make more and you're not crying the 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 money you spend to buy things for this first trip do not forget to smash that like button we want to reach more people as possible and subscribe share with your family and friends and if you are a Portuguese person, don't be ashamed to put comments, no matter if it's in Portuguese or in English, on the comments below, because help me to reach more and other people and encourage me to make more videos about this very nice hobby, bikepacking and bike touring. I need to show you here one bag. This is Caroline's bag. It's a pannier. I don't know if you can see very well. This is some years ago, cost in the, I think Lidl or Aldi, I know I'm sure, uh, 10 euros. And this is type of pannier you can use on your first trip. I actually, I not use this pannier, but I don't know, in one situation or another, uh, you can use this pannier. This pannier, no, it's not waterproof, but have uh, here inside, I think. Let me open. Yeah, uh, not this, uh, this side here, have a cover. A waterproof cover and that's it you don't need more or if you know have a ship pannier i advise you not buy a, a, a worldly pannier for this first trip like i said before avoid spend money on this first trip because you don't know if you like it or not like it it's like if you have an old pannier it's all right if not a rucksack 15 20 liters put on the or back is only two days 50 kilometers or or 100 kilometers in two days no matter another time i tell you not expend money in the gps like this example is super expensive it's i don't know about uh, with sensors going uh, 500 euros and uh, up and you don't need it you have your smartphone but i advise you if you don't have the sense of orientation if you don't know where is north south east or west uh, i advise you like in your home uh, go to the google maps printing the area you're planning to to go bike packing or bike trip printing in the paper and leave with you this is why i navigating in spain some years ago and i made 50,000 kilometers with papers uh, is to tell you it's not impossible and only after that i buy a gps because for me the gps is more reliable than the smartphone but behind all this it's better you have the sense of orientation like i said you you know if i'm going by here i can miss one road or another but i know i'm going to that place i planning to to go 
let me know if you have anything I not answer here on this episode, put on the comments below and uh, I try to answer you, your doubts about uh, this first bikepacking trip, first uh, bikepacking trip and bikepacking touring. I'm the Portuguese guy and today we are here on the Santorini space on this beautiful stone sofa I made with my proper hands. I hope you're enjoying and I see you on next episode.